to stay. Please, can't you make room for me? I dare say it's because of you, Mrs. Mendelbright. You know you are. I want you to meet Mr. Fields. He's a stranger in Mayberry. Uh -huh. Mr. Fields, this is... Dame, would you like a hot water bottle or some oil of wintergreen? Oh, uh, no, 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 thank you. Uh, I don't... Dangerous work, and he's so underweight. <laughs> Cooking supper, huh? Yeah. Oh, chili. Yeah. I make it myself. Yeah. No, no thanks. Oh, I got plenty. No, I'll, I'll go on home. You sure? A little chili? No. A little sweet. Taste it. No, I don't. I don't taste that. No, I don't taste it. No thanks. <laughs> Miss now a good thing. Oh, the place was so darn drab. Well, you sure have picked it right up. <laughs> yeah. That set of books got in there. Huh? I'm Mary to think. <laughs> at home. Barn, you're welcome. No, no, I'm way behind on that. Oh, you still got your Mayberry high school. You've really done something with the room. You know that? Well, it's in little touches that make it. Hmm? Yeah, stop, uh, just a minute! Just a minute! Just a minute, please! Uh, Mr. Pike! Where's what? Hot plate. Chili and crackers. Where are they? Uh, well, uh... All the way from Fort Lauderdale. <laughs> oh, Mr. Firefly. You keep it on all night. Well, I'm studying, if you must know. I've seen you sleeping with it all. Kindly leave my house. The way she wants it, that's the way it's gonna be. But, Barney... Take a look! <laughs> oh, I shall. Oh, Mr. Fields. I just love that little blush. Don't want to come over the house for a while. No, no, you're talking to Mr. Independence, you know. <laughs> Keep a certain amount of jail flavor. Yeah, that's right. We don't want to confuse people. <laughs> <laughs> know what that was? Orange crate. Oh. See on the sign, much with that yet. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's very nice, Barney. Well, Hope you'll be comfortable here. Yeah. <laughs> Someday we'll take a trip up there and you can hear it in the flash. How? Well, that's the actor of the man. Hey, look, Paul. The light. Come on. Come on. <gasps> 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 Just getting a little work done. It's a good thing. Back room, I forgot. Gregory Peck, and he was real good. Swell, swell. <laughs> it sure was swell. Let's go. Boy, what a mess. Nice. <laughs> I've looked every day for five days, and I... Just... you go over and have a talk with Miss Mendelbright? Apologize to her. Won't do no good. She's good either. Hey, Barn. How about both of us go talk to Miss Mendelbright? What do you say? She probably... When will she take you back? Well, that's crawling. Now, look, Barn. You don't have a room, and you're miserable. Now, you might... Remember, Bob? That's right. It's your deputy five. Uh, Ain't that what you're saying, Barney? <clears throat> That's right, uh, Mrs. Mendelbright. I, <clears throat> I'm sure I'm sorry about the uh, whole thing. And I'll never cook again. I won't read at night. I'll take out the garbage. Anything. You can raise my rent, but take me back. I want to come home. That is, I'm giving up the room and business. I'm selling my house. Your life for the best. One shouldn't hesitate. <laughs> well, for heaven's sakes. Well, bless your heart. Thank you. And best... I don't like it. I just don't like it. Don't like what? Her marrying that stranger. He's no stranger to her. I'm so excited. Oh, I bet you are. Mr. Fields and I are going straight to Raleigh. He's got the interest groove. Thirty-six hundred dollars and forty-three cents, Barney, and good luck. 
Goodbye, Mrs. Mendelbright. <laughs> About. I just met Mrs. Mendelbright on the street, and she told me she took out all her money, and she's giving it to that guy Fields. She's... Well, I'll admit that sounds a little suspicious, but you got to have more proof to call a fellow a swindler. All oh, proof. <laughs> Four o'clock bus. Let's go nail him. We can't. He'd sue us for false arrest. Uh, Sarah, Sheriff... Ta 3.30. Why don't they call? You know, I was suspicious of that bird right from the start. Well, let's just wait and see. Hmm. We'd go out on the porch and say it. Drinks. Who's that? Well, she's the most faithful member we got at church. Yes. Boy, the way she used to look after me. You remember that time I had that terrible sunburn and I couldn't raise and washed my hair? <laughs> washed your hair? Want to know why? A. A guy. Barney, you're gas. Where did you say you found this side of Mr. Fields? I believe your former tenant left it. I have another glass. Mmm, mm, that's good cider. But you don't want drink any more of that. Mm. Here, drink this coffee. Okay. And if she's in trouble, why don't? Right. Thanks. Come on, Bart. Fields is a con man, all right. Oscar. My shack full. My statue. Uh huh? You know, the thing I put in my clothes. Oh, oh I had you pegged right from the start, Buster, and you want to know how I. About to run off with it. <sighs> Are you all right, Mrs. Mendelbright? Uh, you would have threw me out and taken in this thief. It's my fault, Mrs. Mendelbright. Oh, don't say that, Bart. I like you too, honey. Come on, let's leave. Who is it? It's me, Barney. Oh, uh, come in, Mrs. Well, thank you, boys, for all you did for me. Oh, well. Oh, it's our pleasure. A hundred watt bulb. <laughs> Well, thank oh, that's you. very nice of you. <laughs> and that isn't all. <laughs> well, I'll see you later. All right. <laughs> Bye, Miss. Oh.